good. Excellent. As we have not ever done at any other reading, I would like to leave you with some random musings of a bard. It is not well known, but in the year 1580 AD, a key ship in the armada of Spanish explorer Francisco Pizarro was seized by Incan commandos fleeing the destruction of their empire. This crack squad then navigated across the Atlantic and proceeded to ravage the shipping lanes across the coast of Spain. Okay. Um, <clears throat> RL, these are your quotes. Oh, I know. Yes, they're but they're, I, I know, but people seem to not be impressed that I know that. <laughs> I mean, I, I thought this was common. No, never mind. Um, I am like the Bruce Jenner of the fantasy genre and should accordingly appear on a box of Wheaties. <laughs> <laughs> and as we heard from earlier today, in the tradition of Planet of the Apes, I bring you Elk Pants. The story of the elk who said no. In a dystopian future, elks have gained the ability to stand upright and wear pants, but at a price, servitude. <laughs> I like servitude because it rhymes with gratitude. And that is what I would like to say for those of you at home and those of you here at D20 Games, gratitude. No, thank you. All right, well, that concludes our evening with R.L. McSterlingthong. Uh, if you have any further questions, visit the website. Visit the website. And ask the buy, webmaster. Buy a book. They may be answered inside of it. So, <laughs> yes, in the very we, back. We will be signing, uh, R.L. will be signing and taking photos. Um, Having photos having, taken. Having I'm photos not taking taken. anyone's photos. <laughs> <laughs> I'm we not that way. With RL. So, thank you, and uh, come again. And uh, last but not least, oh. the Yule Tide is obviously caused by the moon's orbit. <laughs> 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 <laughs>